blood was everywhere and it was on everybody. Teresa Reeves is talking about what she and her family witnessed inside this PetSmart when they showed up for a pet adoption day. All of a sudden we just heard this screaming from the front of the store. According to the police report, a volunteer with the Humane Society had this pit bull named Clara on a leash. Clara slipped out of her collar and headed for a small Westie Terrier and started tugging on its ear. Wasn't thrashing around, wasn't doing anything like that. Um, the owner of the dog uh, was, was sitting there and just pummeling her with punches and kicks, saying, effing pit bull, why are you still allowed around here? Effing pit bull, this, that, and the other. Police say that's when the owner, Craig Emery, pulled out his pocket knife and stabbed the pit bull multiple times. Both Teresa and her fiance jumped in to try to intervene. Store employees later told police they used a spray bottle and an air horn, things they use if dogs get into fights. This guy goes into the middle of a family store during an adoption day and just stabs the animal to death. There were, I don't know how many kids around. The man who did the stabbing, his own son, was standing there watching the whole thing and screaming at him to stop. And yeah, it was, it was horror. It was the worst thing I've ever seen. We reached out to PetSmart for a response to what happened. The company says, our top priority is the safety of pet parents and pets in our stores. We are working with the pet parent of the Westie to make sure it makes a full recovery. But this family insists that Westie was fine and Emery should face charges for what happened. The people that were there could have easily gotten those dogs apart from each other. Like, no problem. Both PetSmart and customers who witnessed this are very anxious to see what the police determine at the end of their investigation. Spider-Man and his amazing friends, Iceman and Firestar. Amazing.